We all love to chill out on the couch and watch TV or take a nap. Well, here's a kangaroo who thinks he's part human. So much so, his owners even call him a humaroo because some of his mannerisms are so human. Kim and Neil Haywood run the Patch Kangaroo Sanctuary in South Australia, which is a non-profit charity that looks after wildlife and currently has 26 kangaroos and two wombats. Even though most of the kangaroos look alike, one stands out from the rest, and that's Rufus, the couch kangaroo. Rufus is a bit of a celebrity. He even has his own Facebook, Instagram and YouTube page. He's even had various articles written about him. I myself found out about him from an article in a magazine in Australia. What makes him such a special kangaroo is he loves to relax and sleep on a couch in the family home. Kim said that Rufus took an interest in the family couch the moment he was rescued as an 8 month old Joey. And now every evening at 5.30pm, Rufus would hop from his enclosure to the back door of the house and wait to be let in, so he could chill out on the couch, watch TV and go to sleep. Normally, Rufus leaves the couch to sleep outside at night, but one day he fell asleep on the couch and refused to get up, prompting Kim to start filming him. And thus began his rise to celebrity status. <laughs> Look what I've got for you. Look, would you like an almond? Come on, you're going to come and get your almond? Come to bed? Come on. You're going to come to bed? Rufy. <laughs> Rufy, look what mum's got. Come on. Yeah, it's an almond. Come on. You're going to get down? Come on. <laughs> Rufy, it's bedtime. Mum, you're so very, very tired and I need to go to bed. Come on. You can do it. <laughs> oh, Rufus. Rufus was too young to survive on his own as an eight-month-old Joey and could probably survive in the wild on his own now. But in South Australia, it is illegal to release rescued kangaroos back into the wild. This is to protect the genetic integrity of native animal populations. A rescued animal must not be released if its origin is unknown. Since it's illegal to release kangaroos, they are provided a safe habitat so they can live in a mob as they would in the wild, with all food, water and shelter provided, and without any fear of being hunted by man or predator. But yeah, anyway, these guys are all uh, enjoying sunning themselves in the back garden here. Um, and again, for anybody who doesn't know, they're not in the back garden. They've got this whole area out here, all up there and around around the back up here. So they, they're they not in a back garden. They're in a big enclosure area. The kangaroos, they, uh, they love to lay in the back garden area. Um, they're, they're more sheltered from the wind out there. And they um, also too, they it's like they're safe zone. They feel really safe being close to the house. Um, and if they're in the paddock and anything out there scares them, they'll always run in here um, and feel a lot safer. So, um, yeah, I call this area their, out, their big outdoor pouch because <laughs> it's like I said, their safe zone. So, yeah, so there's all the kids chilling, apart from the few that's outside. Now, I know people don't like seeing animals in cages like in zoos and theme parks, but these kangaroos seem to have it pretty good and seem to have the run of the house. The back door of the house is left open and they are allowed to come into the house as they please, and often do. Just got the door open and if they want to pop in for a little hello they can. But usually, only Rufus gets to sit on the couch 